Welcome to the future of welding education and training. The Vertex 360 Virtual Reality Welding Simulator is a computer-controlled interactive system that simulates arc welding through the use of realistic puddle graphics, movement, and sounds. The Vertex 360 Next Generation has been adapted for the new generation of welders. The system is capable of simulating multiple arc welding processes on a wide variety of joint configurations. There are five major components to the system. They are the machine, the stand, the helmet, the SMAW device, and the GMAW device. The touchscreen monitor houses the controls that allow navigation throughout the program. The USB port found on the front panel is used to upload software or download user data, such as student reports. The back panel has an external audio jack that can be connected to additional speakers, which can help elevate the welding sounds. Volume can also be adjusted using the software. The VGA port allows the view on the monitor to be projected onto a larger screen. The back panel also has a compartment designed for the storage of the swing arm. The operator's manual and welding procedure specification book are located inside the storage compartment on the right side of the system. You will also find the Vertex playbook that provides useful information on tools designed to assist with training ideas and programs for the Vertex. There is also a helmet care and maintenance poster that should be posted close to the system. The stand and table can be moved into multiple positions and configurations. The stand can be used with or without the table. The holes on the coupon arm allow for all position welding, including 2 through 4F, 1 through 4G, and 2, 5, and 6G on pipe. The pipe pin is to be removed only when adjusting pipe position or when preparing the swing arm for storage. Inside of the helmet, you will find the Vertex 360 goggles. These lenses display the virtual environment to the user. By applying gentle pressure, each lens can be shifted left or right to align with the user's eyes. For a comfortable helmet fit, adjust the size of the strap by pushing in and rotating the ratchet knob. The helmet storage hook located on the front of the machine allows for the helmet to be easily accessed while being stored in a safe place. The SMAW device has a rod that represents a stick electrode. This rod retracts when a virtual arc is struck to simulate the electrode burning off during the virtual welding process. When the virtual electrode burns to a stub, the rod will stop retracting and the user will no longer be able to weld. Use the orange Actions and Cues icon to extend the rod into a new electrode. The angle of the rod can be changed by squeezing the handle and rotating the rod into a 45 or 90 degree position. Releasing the handle will lock the position. The GMAW device has a trigger that is used during the simulation of GMAW and FCAW processes to initiate and maintain the simulated weld arc. The coupons are stored in the compartment located on the left side of the system. There are currently six coupons available. The standard coupons are flat plate, T-joint, groove joint, 6-inch Schedule 40 pipe, and the 2-inch Extra Strong pipe. A lap joint coupon is included with upgrade option number 5. The storage decal illustrates how the coupons are properly stored. 